Hi, couple pieces of admin to start today's video. New glasses have indeed come in. I think they look pretty nice. Um, uh, tripod has been ordered. Should be around. Should be available to pick up from Sunday, but God knows when I'm actually going to pick it up, and or when it actually will be available, because you know inconsistencies with companies. Now onto today's days. The first and the only one not really relevant to this video, National Peanut Butter Day. I didn't remember that one because, it's, again, it's the one that's not relevant to this video. Uh, it's peanut butter. I have a weird relationship with peanut butter. I like Reese's. I like, but I got like some regular peanut butter and wasn't a big fan. Uh, maybe I just like Reese's peanut butter. Or maybe I just like Reese's peanut butter. Although I like the peanut butter Kit Kats. So I don't know, maybe it's the combination of peanut butter and chocolate, whatever. It's not important. It's not what today's video is going to end up being. Because today is also... Beer Can Appreciation Day. This is a... Uh, Lemon, lime, IPA, fucking stupid can. Just a bit out of date. The can's a bit dusty. Um, honestly, I don't get cans that much. Um, at least not in it. Well, depends. Some some beers are not good in cans. Desperados, really nice in bottles, awful in cans. Today is also. I always, I basically, I'm just chasing for the wording, exact wording for it. National Compliment Day. Uh, so I've pulled up a list for a whole bunch of compliments, and we're going to read them out. And that's going to be today's video, because I don't want to just have to read out things again. Uh, I don't want to have to just read out the, the days again. I'm obviously still just reading out things, pretty much. Although I probably will give comment on some of them. And I will continue to drink this throughout the video. Um, the remainder of the video. The, the the majority of the <laughs> the the meat the main content. Uh, you're that nothing when people ask me what you're thinking about. Weirdly worded, but I get the point. Uh, you look great today. Classic one. You're a smart cookie. But again, slightly weird phrasing. <laughs> Very weird phrasing. I bet you make babies smile. Which can mean a lot of things. You have impeccable manners, which isn't a compliment if you ask me. Uh, I like your style, which is very preferential. I'm not going to comment on all of them, I just started commenting on them. Uh, you have the best laugh. I appreciate you, because we're still DJ Khaled. Uh, you are the most perfect there is. There's no perfect, nobody's perfect, nobody's close to being perfect. Don't get your hopes up. Uh, our system of inside jokes is so advanced that's the only you and I get it, and I like that. That is, that is, that is my society. I think that's society in general, actually. At least modern society. You're strong, because again, we're DJ Khaled. Your, pers your perspective is refreshing. Now, that is a good compliment. Um, not how I would phrase it personally, but yeah. If you have an interesting point of view, I'm gonna I'm gonna like you more. Uh, you're an awesome friend. You light up the room. You deserve a hug right now. We've been over this. <laughs> uh, you should be proud of yourself. You're more helpful than you realize. You have a great sense of humor. Sense of humor is important. Uh, you've got all the right moves, which could could be a compliment or could be a. A claim of a poorly designed hard AI. Oh, you always have the perfect candidate for me. Me, it's almost like you know what I'm going to do. Anyway, uh. Is there a picture next to charming in the dictionary? Oh, no, sorry. Is that your picture next to charming in the dictionary? Well, uh, I was gonna say. Uh. Your kindness is a bomb to all who encounter it. Okay. Uh, you're all that a supersized bag of chips. You're all that and a supersized bag of chips. Some of these are... I'm also dyslexic, which doesn't help. 
On a scale of 1 to 10, you're an 11, you broke the scale. And are a... What, what was the movie? You know, it doesn't matter. Uh, you are brave. We're done with contractions, apparently. Except for the next one has a contraction now. You're even more beautiful on the inside than you are on the outside. It's usually not true. Uh, just factual, it's usually not true. Uh, something something masks, fairy. Uh, you have cor- You have the courage of your convictions. No, I didn't read that one wrong. Uh, aside from food, you're my favourite. I like that one. Um, if cartoon bluebirds were real, a bunch of them would, would be sitting on your shoulder singing right now. Again, I kinda I kinda like that one's weird, I like that one. Uh You're making a difference. You're like sunshine on a rainy day. It's sunshine on a cloudy day. We're gonna Oh my God. Uh anyway. <laughs> you bring out the best in other people. Your ability to recall random factoids at, at just the right time is impressive. You're a great listener, most people are Either actually good res listeners or pretending to be. Uh, <laughs> the definition, the noticing the difference with the two is not easy. <coughs> I'm drinking. I'm drinking beer. What do you expect? Um, computer's turned off. <laughs> or the screen's turned off. Anyway. Uh, where was I? Uh, how is it that you always look great even in sweatpants? Everything would be better if more people were like you. I bet you sweat glitter. If you've ever heard of a glitter bomb, you know that's not a good thing. Um, you were way cool before hipster. You were cool way before hipsters were cool. That color is perfect on you, which is really oddly specific considering how vague a lot of these are. Hanging out with you is always a blast. You always know and say exactly what I need to hear when I need to hear it. You smell really good. You may dance like no one's watching, but everyone's watching because you're an amazing dancer. Being around you makes everything better. When you say, I meant to do that, I totally believe you. We don't believe you, but eh, we're all lying. You're lying, I'm lying, we're all lying. That's the joke. <laughs> and you're not afraid to be yourself is what... And you're when you're most incredible. Yeah, that, that one's really aimed at the uh, social anxiety people, the introverts and stuff. Which is my crowd, <laughs> kind of. It's a lot of my crowd, is the sort of introverted extroverts and extroverted introverts. We all, we're all in that weird place on the spectrum. Uh, colors seem brighter when you're around. You're more fun than a ball pit filled with candy, and seriously, what could be more fun than that? In brackets, the last bit. Uh, that thing you don't, don't like about yourself is what makes you, you so interesting. You're wonderful. Every day is just blah when it, I don't see you for reals. Awesome. You're in the ho hallway, though, the list. You're awesome. <laughs> You are halfway through the... Oh no, that, like, this is just literally a compliment to the reader for being halfway through the list as we're at 50. That was 50. Jokes are funnier when you tell them. You're better than triple scoop ice cream cone with sprinkles. But probably not as stable. Your belly button is kind of adorable. Your belly button is kind of adorable. Uh, <laughs> it's just oddly specific. Your hair is stunning. You're one of a kind. You're inspiring. If you were a box of crayons, you'd you'd be a giant. You'd be the giant name brands ones with the built-in sharpener. <laughs> you should be thanked more often than you are. Our community is better because as you're in it. Someone is getting through something hard right now because you're, you, because you've got their back. I prefer because you're in their life. Actually, I feel like that would flow better. Uh, you have the best ideas. You always know how to find that silver lining. 
Everyone gets knocked down sometimes, but you're, but you always get back up and keep going. You're a candle in the darkness. You're a great example to others. Being around you is like being on a happy little vacation. You always know just what to say. Which I feel like we've had already. At least some variation on. Uh, you, you're always learning new things and trying to better yourself, which is awesome. If someone based an internet meme on you, it would have impeccable grammar. No, it wouldn't. It's an internet meme. Uh, you could survive a zombie apocalypse. You're more fun than bubble wrap. <laughs> a lot of people are more fun than bubble wrap. Bubble wrap's great, but most people are more fun than bubble wrap. Uh, when you make a mistake, you fix it. Who raised you? They deserve a medal hall for a job well done. You're great at figuring stuff out. Your voice is magnificent. Uh, the people you love are lucky to have you in their lives. You're a you're like you're like a breath of you're like a breath of fresh air. How did I fuck up the one that's a classic? Uh, you're gorgeous, and that that's the least interesting thing about you, which has an unnecessary two at the end of it. Uh, you're so thoughtful. Your creative potential seems limitless. You're the coolest person I know, and I consider my, I saw, well, and I consider myself bet friends with like all the celebrities. It says bet, not best, bet. Good job, uh, whatever this website is. You're irresistible when you blush. Uh, actions speak louder than words, and you're, yours tell incredible stories. Somehow you make time stop and flop. I, at the same time, when you make up your mind about something, nothing stands in your way. Which, again, isn't necessarily... Like, that, I am pretty sure I have written as a character flaw for a D&D &D character. That's not necessarily a compliment. Uh, you seem to know... You seem to really know who you are. Nobody knows who they are. That's kind of the problem. It's one of the problems. Uh, any team would be lucky to have you on it. Uh, assumedly you are good at the thing that the team is necessary or just good at everything because team skills uh, in high school I bet you were voted most likely to keep being awesome in I can't remember if it was high school or college I was nominated to most likely to take over the world I bet you do the crossword puzzle in ink babies and small animals probably love you if you were a scented candle, they'd call it per perfectly imperfect, and it would smell like summer. Which is an interesting caveat. Uh, there's no ordinary... There's ordinary, and then there's you. There's no ordinary. Uh, everything is not... There is no such thing as ordinary. Everything is weird. Uh, you're someone's reason to smile. You're even better than a unicorn because you're real. Unicorns are, were real, they just went extinct. How do you keep being so funny and making everyone laugh? Telling jokes. You have a good head on your shoulders. Or apparently the rest of you is awful, but you show, show, your, the, your head and those shoulders are pretty good. Uh, has anyone ever told you that you have great posture? No, because no one cares about posture. The way you treasure your loved ones is incredible, you know, unless you come from a broken home. You're really something special, and you're a gift to those around you, which might as well be the same thing. Thank you for watching, if you bothered to watch all of this. I'd be surprised if anyone does, but good for you if you did. That might be the song, single longest solid uh, thing I've fil filmed. Full stop, never alone for this series. And we will see you tomorrow.